Hello, I'm Tom from Made by Loop, and this is Highlight. Highlight is a script for After Effects that automatically highlights or underlines your chosen text at the touch of a button. So let's have a quick look at how it all works. So I have the Highlight script docked already here in After Effects, and in my composition you can see that I have a text layer already set up as well. Now let's say I want to highlight the phrase at the touch of a button. All I have to do is select the text layer, and then in the script panel, I'll click in this text box and I'll type at the touch of a button. Then I'll click the highlight button. A little progress bar comes up to show you it's working. And in seconds, we now have a new shape layer all set up for us that's highlighting our chosen phrase. The script has taken care of everything for us. It's created the highlight line and positioned it perfectly behind our phrase. And because the highlight line is a shape layer, you can easily change the colour by changing the stroke colour up here if you wanted to as well. Now, we also have a few options up here in the script panel as well. We've got create underline, we've got animate highlight line, duplicate highlighted text, and we have the option to add some padding here as well. So let's take a quick look at what each one of these does. So first of all, if I get rid of the highlight we've just created, and I'll select the text layer again. And we'll choose this option first, create underline. And I'll click highlight again. You can see that instead of a highlight line, we've now created an underline instead, which is great for those compositions where you just need a subtle highlight rather than a fully blown background behind your text. So that's the underline option. Great for creating underlines instead of highlights. So let's move on to the next option. Again, I'll just get rid of the underline and I'll select the text layer again. Now the next option is animate highlight line. And unsurprisingly, this adds a little animation to the highlighted line for you. So if I just uncheck the underline option for now and I'll check the animate highlight line and I'll click highlight. This time we don't see our highlight line right away. But if I scrub along the timeline, like so, you can see that the highlight now animates on screen. And if we open up the keyframes on this shape layer, we can customize the keyframes if we wanted to. We could add some easing or stretch the animation out a little to create something that suits our composition. So there we are, that's the animate option. Now, the next option is duplicate highlighted text. So if I just reset everything again quickly, and I'll select the duplicate highlighted text option and click highlight. This time you can see that we have our highlight as expected, but with the duplicate option selected, we now also have a text layer as well that contains the phrase that we've just been searching for. And this is really useful because sometimes when you highlight a word with a background, you then may want to change the color of the highlighted text too for a little extra emphasis. So now we can just select this new text layer that's been created and we can change the color to whatever we want and it doesn't interfere with our original text layer. So it gives you a bit more flexibility when creating highlights. The final option we have here is the highlight padding. And as it says on the tin, what this does is add a little extra padding to our highlight line. So if I just reset everything again, and let's say we wanted to add a padding value of about 20 pixels. I'll enter 20 in the box and click the highlight button. And you can see that instead of being sized perfectly to the text, our line now has 20 pixels of padding added to it automatically. And it's worth noting at this point that you can use any combination of these options. In this video, I've just demonstrated them one at a time, but if you wanted an animated underline, for example, all you'd have to do is select both the underline option and the animate line option and the script will take care of everything for you. So there we are. Highlight is a massive time saver when it comes to highlighting text in After Effects. You don't have to mess around with creating shape layers yourself and trying to position them manually. Just enter a word or phrase and hit the button. To find out more about Highlight, check the link in the description. If you like this video, do hit like and subscribe and visit madebyloop.co.uk for more motion design resources.